I try to get back here after every race as quick as possible. I don't know, there's, there's no substitute for it, you know, for me anyway. I mean, some people, they like eating ice cream. I like being out here on the farm. It's just where I call home and it's where I think I'll, I'll end up being for the rest of my life. For Matt Hagen, home is a secluded 500-acre cattle farm tucked away in the rolling hills of Christiansburg, Virginia. This is where he escapes the roar of the drag strip and the hair-raising speed of driving a nitro funny car. There's no pressure out here. There's nobody saying you gotta have a good light. None of that stuff's going on. Don't get me wrong, I thrive on that, but you get to kind of come back here and it's at your pace. You, you pick what you want to do for the day and you go out there and do it. Some guys go back and work on the race car, you know, and I just happen to come back here and, and uh, work with cows. Come on, cows. Come on. There's different things that you can do each day. You just kind of got to pick one. Like tomorrow, I'm going to start, you know, tagging and banding some calves. It's very hands-on out here. I mean, just you never know what's going to pop up, but I enjoy it and I have a lot of fun doing it. And uh, just very fortunate that I'm able to do it for a living. That's number 42. While Matt has labored out on the farm, he has also put in a good deal of work on the racetrack this season, experiencing a meteoric-like rise to stardom in only his first year in the NHRA. I think to be able to run, run for Don Schumacher Racing is huge in itself. I mean, it's taken my career, you know, 10 steps farther than you know I could have done it in, in 10 years on my own you know so it's really came into play uh, a lot faster than I ever thought it would but I feel like I'm still keeping pace with it you know so we'll just have to see you know where it takes us and what happens and hopefully I'll make a long career out of this. It is yet to be seen how long his career as a funny car driver may last but one thing's for sure Matt Hagen is not looking in his rear view mirror. I don't think I'll have any regrets, you know, that's why I jumped in a Nitro Funny Car in the first place. You know, I didn't want to look back one day and say, what if? So, I think we're just going to have fun out here on the farm, have fun on the racetrack, and it's going to be what it's going to be.